Hi, it's Sarah Levin, the Artful Inker. In last week's A Paper Pumpkin Thing blog hop for the I'll Be Yours Paper Pumpkin Kit, I shared with you two projects that used the heart image from the I'll Be Yours stamp set and had the background image from that stamp set inside. And I promised that I would come on back with a video and share with you how to do that so you can use that technique in your own creations. So, let's flip this camera around and get you started. For the I'll Be Yours, a paper pumpkin thing blog hop in January, I showed these two alternative projects, this clean and simple card and then this candy bar wrapper. And both of them use this heart uh, that has the background image in it, and I promised a video for you. So here we go on how to create this heart with the background fill. So we're going to start with our Stamparatus and the I'll Be Yours stamp set. I'm going to start with this heart. And since the heart is a line image, you want to lay it down, make sure you've got it going the right way, and let it take its own shape rather than pressing it to the plate. That way it won't be kind of cattywampus and misshapen. So just picking it up on the plate and then turning it so that I can see it. And I've got my black stamp and write marker and the brush tip. And I'm going to outline this just checking to make sure I'm still in the frame here. For somebody who's a little nearsighted, this is hard for me to do and not have my head down here where you can't see what I'm doing. So sorry for taking the extra time. I am skipping eliminating the words here on the side. I'm going to give that another go here with my marker. And then I'm going to pick this up and huff on it. <sighs> and that remoistens all of the ink that may have dried while I was coloring around the edges. Give it a second to... And there we go. There's our heart. Now, I'm going to take this background image and Stick it on the other side of this plate, about here, and flip the plate around. Now I need to move this heart over so that it lines up with the background image. So we're just going to come right along here, stick this down again with my magnets, okay. And then I'm going to place this on the back side, which will give me a little bit of a guide as I color. I don't know. Let me take the plate off here. Can you see? I don't know if you can see the heart outline on the back. Since my stamp isn't very stained, it may be hard to see that in the image. Now you want to take the side of your marker rather than the tip. That will be more gentle, gentler on your marker. And you're just going to begin to color in inside that outline. Again, I'm not sure whether you can see the outline as my stamp isn't very stained. If you wanted to stain yours, and it's not, any of the colors with red in it are good for staining, um, as is uh, stays on and just not cleaning it off. Okay, I'm going to go over this one more time. Make sure we've got a good amount of ink on here. Same thing, I'm going to pick it up and huff on it. <sighs> and 
and then whoops I'm gonna have to move this one out of the way and we may have to do this a second time okay we're picking up our paper so that's okay because look at this we'll just do this take my little magnet out of the way give it a rub all over and there you go so I prefer not to try and get very close to the edge and then just cut it out and you've got the heart that I made to go on both this clean and simple card and the candy wrap for the I'll Be Yours paper pumpkin alternative. In the description below the video, I'll have a link so that you can check out the other alternative projects for this kit. I'll also have a link where you can sign up for paper pumpkin and create along with us. And each month, my paper pumpkin subscribers receive a Beyond the Box uh, exclusive tutorial bundle um, in their mailbox. That's going out today for the I'll Be Yours kit. So subscribe with me and receive the next bundle. Um, subscribe to my YouTube channel before you hop on over to my blog. This is Sarah Levin, the Artful Linker of theartfullinker.com and Independent Stampin' Up! Demonstrator. Bye! Thanks for stopping in.